be okay. My screen is getting ready. All right, yellow drill. Wait for two men mark. I'm getting chatting stuff up on phone and everything. Y'all know how this works. Less than a minute left. They got Ghost and Scrappy in here both, by the way. They're both snapping right now. They've had a long day, apparently, playing with the new puppy. Also attempted to set up another follower goal, just not quite sure what the reward would be if we made it there. Not less than 30 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Start the music and intro time. Welcome back, everybody, to another installment of Hardcore Hell. This is your first time here on the channel. My name is Dragon. I'm a variety streamer with a bit of a foul mouth, and today, well, not only does this place finally have a name because y'all voted on it, but we got more work to do. More of the same. Just construction work and trying to survive. Probably marking out more stuff. More capitalism, more killing iron golems for iron. You know the usual. Hopefully getting more leather to finish this. Anyways, I can't quite remember what I left off. Ah, there we go. That all we got? Whatever we got more. Get more in here? Nope. Nope. Because I doubt that's going to be enough to finish off these walls. I could honestly probably just mix in the cobblestone walls. Just say screw it. Probably make the whole process go faster. Because it's just me marking out the walls. I don't know. At this point, I've already started with stone brick. I might as well commit to it. Plus, I don't even know if they'd connect. We don't need gaps in the wall. Gaps in the wall lets shit through. We don't need to let shit through. Well, only one way to find out is probably make a cobble wall. Oh, so let me make a sign, go to where the town center is, and reveal what the name is that y'all voted on. Sign. Ready? Welcome to... Welcome to... Wakefield. Yep, y'all voted on Wakefield. Hardcore super flat? Yes, it is! your bed. I know I gotta work on my actual house, but not your bed. We talked about this, man. We talked about this. We talked about this. Th we talked about this the other day. That's my bed. See? My bed. 
Ah, thank you. Figured any time I do a hardcore world, try to give it a bit of a twist. Last one was on floating islands. This one's on a super flat. Let's see here. We survived 15 days in there in this one. Not much tries to kill you in a super flat, surprisingly. Anyways, I got more wall work to do. As well as some actual work on the house. So down in the mines we go. Which only exists for stone. There is... There are no minerals here. Anything I need, I get through trades. Mainly. Well, anything I can't kill an iron golem before I get through trades. Oh, and cat busting open my door. Who's coming in here? Again. The cats have been ding dong ditching me. They shouldn't be, but they are. Well, I think I can kill an iron golem. Can't kill an iron golem for, or chop a tree down for, or take from a chest in the village, or farm. Or look, basically, if it don't exist here normally, I gotta get it through trades. I, I might end up turning into Jeff Bezos. Though I probably won't be as bad as him. But there is a good chance I'll turn into him. If that happens, feel y'all can feel free to start building a guillotine outside my house. iron pick is about to break. Yeah, super flat runs entirely on capitalism. I thought I could escape capitalism in video games, but it follows me everywhere. Hello, stone mason. I do not have emeralds for you right now. Alright, let's see if the cobble walls will actually connect. After I make a new pick, and hopefully we have another iron golem spawn here soon. Y'all making more golems for me yet? Y'all make me more golems? Or am I gonna have to go hunting down other villages for them? No more golems? Alright, let's see these connect. So that way we can finally finish the wall and start actually working on the house. I can't live in the villager hut forever. Dragazon! <laughs> it's Dragazon! Oh my god! <laughs> Good news these connect, but I should have thought. I should have thought of that as the town name. Why didn't I think of that when I made that poll? No, it's called Wakefield. Why didn't I think of that name when I made the poll? No! Too late now. The name is stuck. Maybe we can make a second town eventually and call it Dragazon. Problem solved. Good, these connect. Which means we can... Oh, and hey, May! Thank you for the follow! I do hope you enjoy your time here. The, the stone cutter was right here.
You know something I've noticed here? I'm just now thinking about this. I haven't seen any pillagers. I thought raids could still be possible in Superflat, but I haven't seen any of them. I mean, I know their towers won't spawn. But where are the pillagers? I thought the raiding parties could still show up. Yeah, I probably should have switched over to using cobble cobble walls sooner, shouldn't I? Would have been done with that wall so much faster. Oh well. Hindsight loves to smack me upside the head. Well, sometimes the raiding parties will spawn without well, if you have like a world without structures. But the thing is, is that I don't know if they... But that's like a default world without structures. I don't know if they spawn on any other world type without structure. With with or without structures, that's the thing. That's something I'll have to test on my own later. Do a little science experiment in my off time. Have a normal regular world as the control. Another stack of cobble here. Gotta finish that wall. There we go. They don't? Huh. Okay, no need to do my science experiment. They just don't. Wait, that means no totals of undying. Oh no. Oh no. I already accepted the fact that we can't get like the elytra because, you know, no end. The stronghold doesn't spawn in super flat. And there's a good chance I can get to the nether if I can find enough blacksmiths with obsidian in them. Or somehow find a ruined nether portal. I just don't know if the nether's gonna be super flat or regular. We can put- we can put dragons on in the nether! We can make dragons on our nether base. No, the entire thing is off one. Hardcore just somehow became harder. It became hardcore before we had the totems. Back in my day, when you went on hardcore, you had no totems to save you. And we liked it. <laughs> I don't know where that joke came from, but it just felt fitting. <laughs> I doubt 13 is going to be enough. No, even though this hardcore world is harder than what no hardcore world it normally is, at least we have sand. The last hardcore world was horrible. Because apparently I picked a world type that doesn't spawn sand. And you never realize how much stuff requires sand until you suddenly need it. <sighs> 
So close, shouldn't be much long. Shouldn't be, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 more cobble and run to the house. Must sleep, must sleep before the farmer takes my bed again. Yeah, last world I had no potions because I couldn't make glass for glass bottles. Which was the real kicker, because hardcore without potions is, um... Uh... Yeah. There's a reason the series is called Hardcore Hell. Damn it, Gary, you took my bed again. Yeah, your name is Gary now. I have decided. Don't care what your name was before, you are now Gary. No. 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 Just without sand, no potions, no concrete. No windows. You have to get real creative with Windows designs, which is, a, uh, since I like building, that's, a, uh, that's a bit of a hard one. <laughs> I like making pretty-looking windows. But if I can't get pretty-looking windows, what am I supposed to do? Though it always confused me, because in that world, all the villagers had windows, so I kept wondering where the glass came from. Okay, take out this section, then we'll head back up, because I'm going to need some of this stone for building the house. Sure, that is an option. Fences can work, as well as getting creative a bit with some of the stairs and slabs. But the main reason, the main reason for having this three block layer of sand in this world is because potions, though. I am gonna need potions. Okay, here, let's finish off this fence, then we update the map. Then maybe do a bit of housekeeping. Check on the animals, check on the farms, trade with the villagers a bit to try and go ahead and start my stock get my stockpile of emeralds going. There we go. One finished wall. Sand is magical. Sand is wonderful. Sand is precious. Precious, precious sand. All the sand. Eat all of it. Housekeeping and map updating time. Let's see here, we are good on charcoal for now. So we don't need to worry about chopping these down for more of that. How are the animals doing? Nope, time to make more. And then do a quick little then do a quick little cull. You ain't getting in here, Gary. Last time I let you in my field, you ruined him. I was supposed to hit that one. That one wasn't full grown yet. Mmm, potatoes. And more 
carrots. More. Yeah. Give me the seeds. More beetroot. And now, more potato. See, Gary, this is my field, not yours. Last time I let you in my field, you ruined it. You almost made it to where I had nothing but beetroot. And I cannot live off of beets alone. Well, potatoes are pink. Potato flower. I'm pretty sure potato flowers are actually pink. Also, it's the texture pack. Capitalism. All right. You animals know what time it is. Make the next generation, then, uh, I need some things. All right, y'all got to know your new chil newly born children? I'll tell your newly born children to look away real quick. Tell them you're gonna show them a magic trick. Oh. Oh, good. More leather. That crap wanted to go down in one strike. Y'all saw nothing. And a bunch of these beetroot seeds, let's just put in the composter. Were you having fun in there, Gary? An orphanage for the animal parts. Bold of you to assume we're not doing factory farming. Now I need more sticks so we can finish up that map frame. Am I missing a map? No, I am not. Well, let's go update them. Well, we need to update all the maps. Gary, why don't you buy beetroot? What's that? Oh! Also, can y'all just make another iron golem real quick, please? That cat, what I think it is? <gasps> we need to get fish now, 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 now. Can I fish in the half slab thing? Please, please, please. I can. We need that cat now. I need that cat now. It looks like my real life cat. We need him now. Can I do this in one fish? Can I do this in one fish? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Ghost! Ghost, are you seeing this? It's virtual you again! Oh, look, it's virtual you again! I've got my real life cat. I got two of my cat. I got both my cats in here. And uh, this one looks exactly like my real life one. One of them. This looks like Ghost. Anytime I see this type of cat, I have to get him. Maybe this time we can actually build a temple to my cats. I always tried to do that in every hardcore world, and I always die. That or the cat dies. Come here. Come here. I love you. Come here. I love you. Come here. Love me. Love me. I have salmon. Stay stock still. Love me. 
No! Need another fish. 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 I will get him. I will get him. I need that cat. Yeah, don't let- I will not let ghost be a ghost. No. If it's somehow in real life I can find a way to make that cat immortal, I will. I need another fish. Give me other fish. Drop everything, must get cat. We have cod. No, but the sun's getting ready to set. I can't risk the cat dying in the night. Let's just quickly put these up. Put up the item frames, clear a little space. Gary, get out of my bed! It's not like I'm staying in here forever, Gary. Eventually I'm gonna grab that bed and leave. Is around here. Yes, there he is. Yes, immortal ghost. The immortal ghost. An oxymoron. But it works. Come here, kitty. Come on, I have another fish. I have other fish. I have another fish. I have another fish for you. Please come love me. I have another fish. I love you. Come, I have another fish. Come here. I have another fish. Come love me. Come on. Love me. Love me? Come on, let's get you out of the snow. Come on. No! Another fish! Another! You know, there have been so many stray cats wandering around this whole area the entire time I've been streaming. They're all probably one looking at me going, what the- why is she going after just this one? Why about the rest of us? There have been cats around her the entire time. But no, this one is special. Though if I find also a certain tabby, because, well, my newest kitten, Scrappy, is a tabby cat. We might get that one, too. I really need name tags now. True, but I was on a bit of a streak for a while where each time I tried to tame a cat, I would just need one. Also, how are there fish in this, like, half block of water? How has that happened? Gods? That perfect gets me every time. I don't suspect it. It's the magical sand. The magical sand creates fish. Sand makes fish. Fish come from sand. Come here. I have more fish. Come here, I have more fish. Come get the fishy. Makes fish for magical cat. Yes! My baby! My baby! Is, is he awake? Oh, if Ghost wasn't sleeping, I'd bring him up here to look. But he's sleeping with his little brother. All right, let's get this cat inside. Let's get him inside so nothing ever happens to him. And just to make sure he follows, hold the fish. Tempted with delicious treat. Crap, we're gonna have to figure out how to get like blue, I think wandering traders. Hold on, I just realized I need to Google something. I just realized I need to Google something. Can wandering traders spawn in super flat? Okay, yes they can. Alright, 
right, come on, kitty. Time to go to our temporary base of operations. Now, you can lay on my bed. Gary cannot. All right? Remember, you are allowed on the bed. Gary is not. Gary! Get out of here, Gary. Wait, you're not Gary. Who the hell are you? There was a strange man in my home. There's another strange man in my home. I don't like it. That's it, we're moving. Gotta build the house now. The thing is, they don't... The, the corn flowers don't spawn in here. Because if we look at the biome here... Let's see here. Yeah, it's a snowy tundra. Unfortunately, cornflowers do not spawn in snowy tundras. So I'm gonna have to hope and pray a wandering trader comes around at some point, sells me a cornflower, and then we can give ghosts the proper co collar color. Yeah, not supposed to go there. Basic shape of the house. Now I need more wood. Have they made another iron golem yet, or am I gonna have to go invade a couple other villages? Am I gonna have to become the raiders myself? <sighs> Guys, come on. Don't make me raid another village. Make me an iron golem. Or has the town become too safe for y'all to need them? I'm gonna have to see if I can make a redstoneless iron farm at some point. And I still need to finish my, my, fill, filling out these. Need to make sure they're accurate. there that one goes there pick up this one update it and boom complete map this ain't the permanent spot for the map but this is where it's gonna be for now and as the town grows and changes so shall the map I hear him meowing. I hear him meowing. Don't worry, you will not be stuck in this tiny home with strange men forever. So have y'all made another golem yet? Cause I need iron. Like now. Am I gonna have to let zombies chase y'all for a bit? <sighs> time to go raid a villain. Another looks like it's time for me to go be a raider. I can't get raiders, but I can be the raider. Should be an iron golem over here. I need to make gates. I completely forgot to start making gates. I need planks. Dragon, you need planks. Stop 
No, wait, actually, no, in the end, she did get rid- No, wait, in the end, she did end up marrying the prince and moving into the castle. So, so even in the regular story, she was not stuck in this small house with strange men forever. <laughs> Target locked. This man dies today. Good, he's in nowhere he can climb. Hello, good sir. Do, do not mind me. I'm gonna just, uh, make a little something real quick. And, uh, you know, just gonna admire my blade. Ha! Come on. Come on. Give me the iron. Yes. Those fools are all still stuck there. Can I make it home in time? I better be able to make it home in time. I need to see my boy! I need to see my boy! You know, thinking about Snow White... What the hell was up with the prince? Man finds a seemingly dead girl out in the middle of the woods and thinks, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna kiss a dead body. Ghost? Ghost? Ghost, no! Come back, ghost! Ghost, no! It's safer in here! Please! Oh, thank the gods. Let's just stay in here, baby. Oh. No risk of death for him. He brought me a feather. I about had a heart attack. All I could think of is where- all I could think was, where's my boy? Where is he going? Alright, I still need to- I still need to upgrade that mason. Where is he? There he is. Good, last time I had to buy bricks from you. Now come on, give me the stone trade. Give me the stone trade. <laughs> the man had his shoes. The man had his shoes. The man had some serious issues. <laughs> no wonder he wasn't at the castle much. The man, the, the man was into some weird things. Alright. Question of the hour, can I... Well, I guess it's time to practice the MLG stuff. Even though I don't do MLG much. You know, honestly, a lot of fairy tale princes are screwed up. Cinderella! The dude forgot what she looked like. <laughs> Best friends with the great cover owner. Yeah, dude, dude forgot what she looked like. Pretty much after, you know, spending an entire night with her and apparently falling in love with her completely. And try to go around by, you know, giving her, you know, by, you know, Having every single woman in the kingdom put on a shoe. For completely forgetting the fact that sometimes people have the same shoe size.
Ah, I forgot to, forgot to do it. Yeah, do climbed up her hair. Oh, the original tale of Rapunzel is a whole lot worse. I mean, most of the original fairy tales are a whole lot worse, but uh, Rapunzel is one of the ones that takes the cake. Along with Sleeping Beauty. Guess who has copies of the original? Me. I actually do have a copy of the Grimm's Fa Brothers Fairy Tales. And I'm reading that and I'm sitting here thinking how the- Each time I'm reading those, I'm sitting here thinking how the hell did Disney think these were okay for children's movies? I-I just gotta know. Which Disney executive looked at so many of those stories and thought, yeah, this will be great children's entertainment. I want to know which Disney executive it was. I swear I just want to talk. I, I just want to make sure they're okay. Dissected by a husband. There are also some versions where the wolf actually does get away or does something a whole lot worse to Red Riding Hood that I will not say on here because I don't want Twitch overlords to suddenly decide that now is the time to get rid of me. I will not go Twitch into destroying me. I will not taunt Twitch. I will not taunt the Twitch overlords into destroying my channel. Let's just say the Germans, uh, the Germans are into some weird shit. Nope. Timing was off. I got it that time. Safe way to practice MLGs without dying. long words. Long words that uh, often sound more like it. The polite ones sound like insults and the insults sound like they're being nice. Though really I only understand one phrase in German and it's literally Sprechen Sie Deutsch. Do you speak German? That's not gonna help me much, if that's the only phrase I know. Asking people if they speak a language I don't speak.
That's gonna help me. That's gonna help me a lot if I ever visit Germany. I mean, I mean, it means you at least understand the phrase, but you're not fluent in the language. So I guess you are technically not lying. Let's see, that's the only phrase I know in German, and the only thing I remember from French class is je dois le sandwich. Because of the damn inside joke. Those are the only bits of foreign stuff I know. Well, at least foreign languages I know. I- I ain't gonna get far. There's a reason I ain't traveling the world, because I don't know any language other than English. And I'm not gonna be that person. I'm not gonna be your average American tourist. I refuse to be that. You can see you start connecting everything. Does not go there. Ah! Night time a cometh! Night time a cometh! Run! The night to cometh! Oh, the animals grew up. Gotta go feed them. Gotta feed them in the morning. Gary, get out of my bed. Get on my bed and stay away from my cat. Actually, no. Sell me some pie. Okay, now get out of my bed and stay away from my cat. Y'all made a new golem yet? This place is lacking in golem. And we ain't talking about the we ain't talking about the funky little dude from Lord of the Rings. on the house. And one, two. Let's see here. Got about ten minutes left for I gotta for gotta get off for the night. Oh, I am so sorry. I always make it a rule of myself. I always I always make it a rule if I have to go traveling. Don't be that American tourist. I don't know how your family managed to pull it off when you're not American. I am so sorry you have to- t I'm so sorry for that. And it's your own capital too. Granted, when you're visiting a place, don't act like you live there, because who wants to go to the DMV when they're on vacation? But don't be the average American tourist. Don't be that one. Just, just don't. Be 
be a guest, not a tourist. And don't fall for the tourist traps. Even though it's hilarious that when I'm at work, I can see exact- Because we're right by an interstate, I can see exactly which types of families are going to get hit by the nearby tourist traps. And I'm sitting here thinking, I could warn them. I could warn them, because they're talking about going, because they've seen the signs. I could warn them. Shirts with hoodies with London on them colorized with the Union Jack. But why? But why though? Why? Did they ever tell you why? Why would they do that? Back on with the tourist traps thing, yeah. I, there is... Because again, because we're out along the interstate and we're in a very tourist-heavy... And I'm nearby a very tourist-heavy area. Again, not naming names. But each time I see the exact type of family I know is going to get hit by the tourist traps and they are not gonna... And they are gonna regret it, absolutely. I'm sitting here thinking each time, I could warn you. I could warn you, but would you listen? You were the only one dressed normally? You do realize when you dress and act like a tourist in it, it, it D did they not realize that if they get dressed and act like tourists anywhere, they were basically putting a giant sign above their head, basically a giant flashing neon sign above their head that says, Sucker, I have money. I, have I, I will fall for the tourist traps. If they're all completely decked out in the city's memorabilia, you know, you know the tourist traps are going to get them. Surprised and also understandable for the hatred. It's it's completely understandable. I get it. If an English person came across me in the middle of the street and decided to start beating the shit out of me, I be, I would just look at them and go, understandable. Have a nice day. Got everything connected? We should. Yep. <laughs> yeah, if anybody ever comes across comes across, you know, an English person being the hell out of American tourists and the and the or at least an American person who's, you know, and they're just going, you know, no, understandable why you're why you're trying to beat me to death. Yeah, that's probably me. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. I'm pausing the game here. I I need to process what I just read. Why? And another question. Why? Oh, I know we're weird. I know we're weird. But, but you would think it's in the name. It's in the name. By the gods, it's in the name. 
It's in the name. I'm just trying to process that because I'm just I'm trying to see where the synapses in their brain did just not fire off. Where they just did not make the connection. Hmm, we're in England. The people people here are called English people or Englishmen. Hmm, I wonder if they speak English. I, I just why? Y'all did own us. Yeah, y'all did own did own us two hundred years ago. In the grand scheme of things, that was not that long ago. We still speak your we still speak your language, though we just sound we just sound different, just slightly different. But that's just accents are just being weird. I'm just still trying to figure out where their synapses in their brain just did not work. I got. As far as I know, I have one working brain cell, and even I know. Oh, English people. Probably speak English. Okay. Y'all gonna make an iron golem yet? Ah, the farm's been a growing. I just need to wait on more trees to grow. <laughs> I threw the tea in the river to common sense too. Apparently! Apparently, and at some point I picked it back up. Again, we are also the type of people who need, you know, warning labels that hot things are hot and that some or that in order for us, for some people to believe organic foods are actually organic, but they gotta stick like bits of grass and stuff on the organic stuff, which is an actual thing. <laughs> there was a place that would place hay along with their with their organic eggs just so people would actually believe they were organic. I am not proud of my country. Okay, gotta make a new pick. And I need another iron golem. Can y'all make me another iron golem, please? Okay, get some of this smelting up. Oh. Hey, ghost. Who's a good kitty? And the actual real life ghost is. Oh, he's awake! Hey, ghost. Oh, you're gonna ignore me? Alright. Hey, no. I'm gonna replace this door with an iron door. First chance I get, I swear. Get out of my bed. Out of my bed, out of my bed. My bed. My bed. You hear me? My bed and my cat. Oh, God, that's hurting my brain. That is a wonderful note to end this off on. Oh, my God. Oh god, that's like, that's up there with the fishbowl earth theory. With that wonderful note, I'm afraid that's all the time I've got for tonight. So for those of you who did tune in, I do hope you enjoyed. I will be back tomorrow night for some more Hall Night, so I do hope to see you there if you can make it. Follow me on Tumblr and Twitter at Hats and Dragons, and join the Discord for any updates to the stream schedule, some shit posting, memory, occasional bit of memory, life things, all that lovely stuff. 
and subscribe to the YouTube channel for any Twitch highlights and VODs I haven't uploaded up there.